I'm George Nathaniel and I work here at Palmar Barbers which has been established since 1896 and I'm here to talk about various styles of barbering. Hi, today we'll be demonstrating how to do a faux hawk. First things first, I'll be taking the number two up to where the temple is, approximately about there, leaving this section here and here to where we'll be growing up as a pyramid shape. Now, the two will be followed around across here, okay? And we'll be doing exactly the same thing on the other side, okay? Bringing it right round into the neck, creating a semi-V into the neck. All right, so taking the number two, now, as I get to this part here, I will be bringing it across and down. Keep combing the hair. Always pulling the ear back. And the good trick is also to stand back Looking at the hair, if you're too close, you're too above it, the visual isn't, isn't so good. Do the same again on the other side. Okay, bring it across down again like we did on the other side. All right, so I bring it across, stand straight across the neck hair. I can see my angle into a V. V for victory. All right, I'm grabbing the small clippers. This is over comb across the hairline. Okay. Combing it down always. Now I'm just trying to create a slightly natural hairline here. With clippers. Right, so what we have here, slightly more weighted around here, so what I want to do is take the number one. Okay, and just bring that up across there, just to take out that totally defined line a little bit, all the way across. Now with the zero, I'm just tapering it in to the hairline, just on these edges here. So you've got a nice blend in. Right, with my texture scissors, I'll be texturizing, blending it in, texturing and blending at the same time. Okay. There's also another method which you can use, taking normal scissors, okay, and point cutting. Right, so, you can also point cut across, all right? There's quite a few different methods you can use. These are the two I've just shown you, okay? All right, there is another one more, okay? Which is grabbing the razor, okay? And just ever so slightly, and it just creates a slight feathered look, so you've got that movement coming across there, okay? And we'll probably do the same as we get to the top here. All right, and we do exactly the same thing on the other side. So my desired length at the top here, where the ridge is, this is my ridge at the top here, okay? I wanna keep that as long as possible, okay? Now, what I want to do is just bring, bring this at an angle, okay? Okay, and just there is a slightly texture here by chopping into it all the way across to where the crown area is. So what you're doing, you're creating a flow into like a, what I like to call a pyramid. Okay, same on the other side. We're just taking a few excess hairs which are the, around and making sure that they're both even on either side. Okay, just blow drying 
all the loose hair, put it in its direction, help it through before we put any products in and style it up. Just grab some of our Camel Barber's Mutt Mad. Okay, just a little bit on our fingertips, rub it into our palm, okay, and then just glide it into the hair. Making sure we get it all through the hair too. Now what we want to do is just create that roundness there, okay, which you can just start pinching it with your fingers. Right, so this is how we do a faux hawk hairstyle.